this video, I just want to mention that these are cartoons that are not affiliated with the WWE, but have featured WWE wrestlers with their voices, so no Camp WWE or Hulk Hogan's Rock and Wrestling. With that all clear, here are five WWE wrestlers who appear in cartoons. Listen up, maggots. Sergeant Slaughter became the first real-life personality to feature as a character in the animated series G.I. Joe, a real American hero. The loud-mouthed American badass is described as the toughest of all the Joes, and is depicted as having superhuman strength and endurance. In fact, in one episode he was able to fend off dozens of Cobra troops just by himself. Slaughter's character was first introduced in the episode Rise Serpent to Arise Part 1, and he served as a drill instructor, just like he did in real life. Fun fact. His character was so popular that several Sergeant Slaughter action figures were made, and these figures went on to become the most successful G.I. Joe toy character. The late great Macho Man Randy Savage made an appearance in an episode of Dexter's Laboratory back in 1996 as the muscular, teal-coloured Macho Man called Raslaw. Raslaw is an intergalactic wrestler with godlike strength who would travel from planet to planet challenging the most powerful fighters. In the episode Dial M for Monkey, Raslaw, Raslaw arrives at Earth and challenges all of Earth's superheroes, the Justice Friends, in a contest of strength and skill, and if no one can beat him in a wrestling match, he will destroy the Earth. Rassler defeats all of the superheroes until Monkey is left. After putting up a fight, Monkey is defeated, however does not give up, despite getting beaten all the time. Rassler admires the Monkey's tenacity, and so decides to spare Earth. The episode ends with Rassler shouting, Oh yeah! The famous catchphrase that we all love hearing the Macho Man say. The Rattlesnake, Stone Cold Steve Austin, made an appearance in the animated series Dilbert, which ran for two seasons from 1999 to 2000. In an episode titled The Delivery, Austin is a judge presiding over a court hearing. You can already sense where this will end up, as we already witnessed Austin as a doctor. In the episode, Dilbert gets pregnant with a child of a cow, a hillbilly, robot DNA, 17 engineers, an elderly billionaire, and an alien. Rather f up, I know, and each try to claim custody of the child. After Austin is introduced as the judge by a news reporter, he makes his way to the courtroom and delivers a stunner to the news reporter, and does his usual trademark things like drinking cans of beer and sticking up his middle fingers. It's pretty funny to watch, actually, if you haven't already seen it. The Nature Boy Rick Flair guest starred in a 2011 episode of the adult animated Family Guy spin-off The Cleveland Show. The episode called BFFs saw Cleveland take his friends on a camping trip in an effort to bond with them. The camping trip is hosted by none other than the Nature Boy Rick Flair, who yells his signature WOO in pretty much every single segment he's involved in. It's just so hilarious to watch, especially when Flair incorporates his catchphrase into the word canoe, when he says, now put on your wigs and have fun in your canoe. Canoe. Well, that was f***ing dreadful. It's so funny, you will just have to watch it for yourself and see. Woo! The hitman, Bret Hart, made a cameo appearance in an episode of The Simpsons back in 1997 called The Old Man and the Lisa. In the episode, Mr. Burns becomes bankrupt and asks for Lisa to help him become rich again. Bret Hart purchases Mr. Burns' mansion and complains that the place smells like old man stink. He then calls Mr. Burns a pitiful pencil neck geek. Vera Hart was very insistent that his character would wear his trademark pink wrestling attire in the episode. Hart said, It's so cool to be part of a show that makes people laugh really, really hard. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please show your support by leaving a like and sharing this video, as it really does help us a lot. Don't forget to comment below too, and we will pin up the best comment. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a video from us. Lastly, for daily wrestling facts and more, follow all of our social media accounts, which are on screen and in the description. Thanks, and until the next video. Woo!